I'm on a pending asylum. If I get married to a green card holder, will I be able to get a green card also? Maybe, maybe not. This is a controversial issue because um, if you have an asylum case pending, most likely, uh, you know, your the initial status you enter the United States with um, has expired. So you're on this pending asylum case status. It's not status, but this situation you're in. Uh, there's some interpretation on the on the law that says uh, even if you don't have that underlying status but you have an asylum case pending, you can still file for adjustment of status based on marriage, for example, and get the green card. Now, I had a colleague get that uh, a month ago. But some offices will say, no, you don't have any underlying status, so you can't adjust that. So if you're married to a US citizen, you could, that would have been solved. But because you're married to a green card holder, you need to have underlying status. There's a chance that an officer may deny that. Uh, in that case, you have to appeal, maybe sue and stuff. So it depends on which where you're going and which officer is gonna interpret it which way. Unfortunately, I've seen it happen both ways on this. It sucks that immigration law is like that, but it could work both ways. But if you have an asylum case pending, um, there's less risk of you being sent to court, so it might be the thing to do. But you should consult with an immigration attorney in private and have them help you on that case. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please click subscribe down here and ring that bell to get the latest updates. Also, please follow us at the links above on these various social media sites to catch the latest information, live videos, and more to help you be updated on U.S. immigration.